What's up everybody, my name is Luigi Newton. I'm a property investor and property developer from Nottingham, England. Today I wanted to talk to you about something called the law of attraction. This is something that I've been doing for the last seven years and it's really helped me to transform my life. When I was younger, I was really in a bad place, getting in loads of trouble, and now I'm doing uh, property developing full time. I just wanted to share my experiences and just talk to you guys about how I've managed to implement the law of attraction and kind of a bit of tips and tricks that you guys can use as well that will maybe help you. The law of attraction, I'm no expert, but I can speak on it from how it's helped myself. My explanation of the law of attraction is when you align the universe with your wishes and what you think is what you will attract. So what you put your focus on is what will actually come into your life. So if you're thinking really negative thoughts, then I don't believe you'll be able to get attract the things what you want to. But if you're focusing on positive thoughts, then more positivity will come in. For example, myself, if I'm constantly thinking about owning my next property, it will actually come into my life. So that's what I'm really trying to focus on. Let me tell you examples of how I've used the law of attraction to actually attract the things that I want. So for the last four years, I've had a photo on my wall of this exact car. Now this car, I just got it delivered today and it's basically been on my wall for the last four or five years. And it's something what I've really wanted and it's something I've visualized myself in many, many times. Disclaimer. The law of attraction will only work if it's followed up by massive action. You can't just sit back and wait for things to come. That's one example. Another example is I used to work in a call center selling insurance to people. And what I'd actually do is I'd visualize myself when I'm at the desk being full-time property. I used to vision myself, you know, running from property to property, having a lot more time, a lot more freedom. And I used to really picture myself as just in that job, just for a short amount of time and I used to know that this is only temporary I used to always tell myself that so how can we actually practice the law of attraction what steps can we do to actually implement the law of attraction so there's three things I like to do the first thing is something called morning gratitude affirmations so this is as soon as I wake up I'll basically say in my head I'll be thanking God for all the things that are in my life right now so this can be for my family for my mom you know for my camera guy for uh, certain friends for my car for my apartment these are just things what I'm, I'm listening in my own head I basically thank God for all the good things that are in my life it's not just uh, materialistic things this can be like literally anything anything you're grateful for you just thank God or thank the universe if you don't believe in God and that really helps you because once you appreciate what you do have you'll actually get more of what more of that good stuff will start coming in another thing that I do is morning visualizations now if anyone knows me closely you'll actually know that as soon as I wake up, the first thing I do is I go on YouTube and I type in billionaire visualization. And there's like the top four videos, if you click on them and you watch them, literally it's amazing. It'll put you in the right frame of mind for the whole day. Another thing that I do is I like to set super clear goals at home and have my whiteboard and I'll have goals of things that I want to achieve one year from now. Now this really helps me because it, every time when I'm walking past into the kitchen, I look up and it's got my goals one year from now. What do I want to achieve? Uh, there might be a profit goal. Well, for myself, I want to hit, hit £10,000 profit uh, from property alone every month. So that's one of my goals. I think write them down. I use a whiteboard. You don't have to use a whiteboard. You could use a, a picture or anything that you can see all the time. So they're the three tips that I'd use. So the first one is the morning affirmations saying things that you're grateful for. The next one is a morning visualization. So go on YouTube, type in uh, billionaire visualization, millionaire visualization, and look at these luxury things uh, as soon as you wake up. And then setting clear goals and making them visible. So you can use a whiteboard, you can use your phone, you can use a picture on the wall. Just set your goals and put them on the wall so they're super visible. They're my three tips. I hope that helps. Now, research on optimism actually shows that optimists enjoy better health greater happiness and more successes in life so optimists don't focus on the failures they focus on what good things are happening in, in their life and more actually will come in now one of the foundations of therapy is changing your self-talk so if you know anyone that's been for therapy or yourself if you've ever been to, to therapy they will actually tell you that you need to change the way you're talking to yourself so instead of saying oh i'm not good enough i'm shit i'm lazy i'm a loser instead of saying these negative things we really want to start talking to ourselves in a better way saying i'm great i'm amazing i can do this have you ever heard the saying birds of a feather flock together 
if you're hanging around negative people and you have negative friends, you will become like that. That's just it. You know, you need to be around people what uplift you. You need to be around the right type of people. Now, for me, right now, what am I visualising for myself? I'm visualising high cash flow and properties. I'm visualising more property, more income and more freedom. And that's me checking out.